Hi guys, this is Leslie. I wanted to share a really quick tip that my Aunt Phyllis showed me years ago. This is how to save yourself 50% off on toilet paper. This is the way most toilet paper comes. We only use Scott here, and quite frankly, I do not get paid to say this. I think you should only use Scott. It's pretty, uh, my plumbers have always told me I only use Scott for a variety of reasons. So we use Scott. My Aunt Phyllis had showed me and told me that this was something she had been taught by somebody. When you get a roll of toilet paper, you mush it, you step on it on the outside, or you mash it down with your hands. Because what happens when, especially this is a great way to save toilet paper if you have children. So you put this on and this causes an automatic tug, so to speak, when you're rolling it out. And if you are like me, my children would get this roll of toilet paper and go like this, and they would just take reams and reams of toilet paper. So by putting this little half in it, uh, like, you know, smushing it down, it creates a tug so that they can't really take as much as they might like, and they have to work a little harder. And I think that I found that with my children, it prevented them from just taking reams. I would call it a baseball mitt of toilet paper, just a ream and ream, and then roll it some of them rolled it around their hands, rolled it around their hands, and just would have this big baseball mitt of toilet paper. Sorry about this conversation. But anyway, this is a great way to prevent your children and or you from using too much toilet paper. It is so simple. I have heard of people who cut this in half this way and then only have that much. That might work also, but that's too much work for me. I can smush, I can't cut. So this is a quick and easy way for you to save I'd say at least 50%, if you have young kids, at least 50% of your toilet paper roll, your toilet paper um, bill, um, because you just, it's just harder to get off. Thank you so much for watching. This is Leslie. I hope everything is going well in your um, neck of the woods. And until next time, thank you so much for watching.